Welcome back to Great Taste of Manitoba. Well, we've impressed the group of people who came over for the game, uh, but you know the old saying, win or lose, we have to have a decent beverage pairing. And so Sheila Nash, Manitoba Liquor and Lotteries, is going to take care of that in just a second. But first, uh, why don't you walk us through what we did today, what we created. All right, well, our first recipe was the mocha java chicken chili, and that had the cocoa in it, the coffee, and, of course, some beer. And then the second recipe was our Blue Moon Chicken Bites with the creamy blue cheese, the hot sauce. Fabulous. We knew it was going to be good, but it was uh, over the moon good. Can we say that? Perfect. Over the it moon fits. good. The recipes for this show and the complete series of great tastes are available on the greattastesmb.ca website. And one recipe from today's show will be in the classified section of the Winnipeg Free Press. All right, Sheila, we could sort of hear you wandering around chanting mocha java chicken chili, mocha java chicken chili. <laughs> what did you come up with? Well, you know, honestly, the first thought that comes to mind is beer. It was, it was the right choice, but I thought it was far too predictable. <laughs> so I went the other end of the spectrum. I went with wine. Uh, and to start with the mocha java chicken chili, I uh, really wanted to play off some of that chocolatey sort of earthy characteristics. Mm -hmm. And uh, I came up with Ghost Pines Merlot. Uh, fabulous Merlot coming from California, uh, predominantly Sonoma. It also has just a touch of Petite Syrah. What does that mean? Well, it means not only do you get fresh fruit, but you also get a little bit of sort of mocha, chocolate, dark spice characteristics in it. Pairing with chili can be tricky when you get into red wines because of the tannins, but this is really soft and easy drinking, and it also works with a little bit of the proteins and, and the nice texture uh, weight-wise in the mouth. So I think it's going to pair up really nicely, complement some of those earthy, rich, deep characteristics, and, uh, and be just easy to drink, of course, on its own. Next was the Blue Moon Chicken Bites, with all of the, uh, the blue cheese and a little bit of heat in there. Decided to have some fun with this, so uh, I've picked out two whites to, to uh, start with. Of course, uh, Apothic White. This is a very popular blend. It's got some Chardonnay, it's got some Riesling, it's got some Moscato, which is always very aromatic, and you get this nice sort of lovely, uh, just a touch a sweetness there, which I think is going to work well if with a little bit of heat there, but also it's got good acidity and it should uh, cut through that creaminess from the blue cheese. On the other end of the spectrum, I've got Whitehaven from Marlboro. This is coming out of New Zealand. Pinot Gris, another really popular grape varietal, but this one's got just a little bit more weight behind it. It's nice and creamy. It's going to, that acidity is still there. It should cut through that blue cheese, but it's going to hold its own because if the wine is too light, it's just going to fall apart in the mouth and nobody likes that. So this should complement uh, the dish quite well and the other thought I had was you know what it's a group you're entertaining cocktails are lovely but we know they're high maintenance when you've got a lot of people so let's keep it easy you can either do the beer thing or just pop open a couple of bottles have something for everyone that's going to work be very versatile and I think uh, certainly these two selections will do that and of course you know California is uh, the 2016 theme country for Winnipeg Wine Festival so another great place to come on down and try some excellent choices there as well. Well, we did it. Fed a large group of people very quickly, very easily. Karen Armstrong, Manitoba Chicken Producers, thank you very much. Sheila, thank you for being here yeah. as well. Uh, we got to break up a fight in the back, though. Those uh, Blue Moon Chicken Bites, they're the crew's like scrapping big time, so we got to go break that up. Make sure you join us next week. Manitoba Turkey Producers will be here, and we will be slow cooking with turkey. Thank you very much for joining us right here on Great Taste of Manitoba. Great Tastes of Manitoba is presented by Manitoba Liquor Mart. Great Tastes is brought to you by GreatTastesMB.ca. Local farms, local foods. Great Tastes is sponsored by Manitoba Agriculture, Food and Rural Development. Great Tastes is produced in cooperation with participating Manitoba commodities and Manitoba Agriculture, Food and Rural Development. Promotional consideration is provided by the Winnipeg Free Press. We're there for you. Great Tastes is produced by Frank Digital.